All right, a new flavor a couple days early at Donkey Donuts. Yeah. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive and man, I'm gonna try to persuade you into something brand new from Dunkin' Donuts, the Peppermint Mocha Iced Coffee. That's right, the Peppermint Mocha flavor is back. I've never done a review on the Peppermint Mocha. Now, if you watch my channel at all, you know that I love to put mocha into any concoction of my iced coffee. So this does it for me. I just have to order the Peppermint Mocha. Here it comes, cream and sugar. We're not gonna waste any time. Stir it up, and uh, we're gonna give it a shot. Wish me luck. Now, a little side note before I try this. This is really not supposed to come out until Tuesday. My local Dunkin' Donuts had it a couple days early, so we are going to give it a shot now before the official launch. So, wish me luck again. Peppermint Mocha Iced Coffee, new from Dunkin' Donuts. Here we go. Okay. Okay, Dunkin' Donuts. This has a chance to be one of my all-time favorites. Whew. Yeah, because right off the bat on this first sip, you get hit with the mocha that I love. I love the mocha flavor in an iced coffee, but that peppermint flavor is subtle. I was like, oh no, is this gonna be too much? Because I don't actually love peppermints. I mean, I can deal with it. You know, I eat the Andes candy mints from time to time but I'm not a huge fan of peppermint or spearmint or any of the mint family. So I was kind of worried with this going in if it was gonna to be too much, but let's give it another sip. Yep, that's good. So yeah, there's nothing really more to say about this except it has a great mocha flavor and the peppermint flavor is subdued. I mean, it's there and it's enough to say, hey, Look at this, there's some peppermint in this. But other than that, it's not all up in your face with peppermint, all up in your face with mocha. It's a nice little mixture, more mocha, less peppermint. You're welcome. <sighs> yeah, I endorse this. Right off the bat, I endorse this. I am an endorser of this. It's good, yeah. So let's rate this, shall we? On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning, don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of, uh, I'm going to give the new peppermint mocha iced coffee flavor from Dunkin' Donuts a rating of, ninety. One. I'm going to give this a 91, so I'm pretty sure that that falls a little bit short of my favorite, which I believe is pumpkin mocha or cookie dough and mocha. One of those two are my top flavors of iced coffees from Dunkin' Donuts, but a 91 is nothing to sneeze at, you know, unless you got a cold. But I mean, it is what it is. It's peppermint mocha, it's done well, and it is a nice change of pace for the holiday season from the folks over at Dunkin', so what do you want from me? There you go, another review in the books. Please like, please comment, and please subscribe. Also, don't forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media that gets the word of the endorsement out to the masses. So uh, yeah, quick little review on this new product from Dunkin' Donuts. Doesn't come out till Tuesday. Maybe your local Dunkin' Donut has this flavor out currently now. And if so, go get you some. Hey, what's up? Bonus footage. Let me just tell you a couple things. YouTube's been acting a little crazy over here on my channel lately. So if you're watching this and you are a subscriber to mine, definitely go back and check that you are actually subscribed to my channel. I know YouTube's been dropping a lot of channels lately and I just wanna make sure that if you are subscribed to my channel and you wanna see my content, you enjoy my content, that the content should be coming out to you in notifications and emails. So definitely check to make sure that you are subscribed to me. I would appreciate it. 
Also click that little bell so you can get alerted and uh, get the notifications that I dropped a new uh, review because as you know, I don't have a set schedule when I uh, put out these uh, videos. They're just, you know, flying by the seat of my pants.